So what I'm expecting price to do is price should clear this. We have ounce of liquidity. This this supply won't be valid. No, it won't be valid. So we have ounce of liquidity. Price should clear everything here. This will stand as liquidity for the week. For this week, you know, I told you something about this week also. This week, our uh, what? Our money. This week also. This one is money. So I'm uh, I'm uh, expressing money. price. Yes, I'm expressing price to. Yeah, to make use of the week. You can adjust the stop loss because of manipulation. Now, I'm expressing price to make use of this week. And four, massive. Massive, yeah. This is what I'm expecting. Now, this place has turned to inducement for this. So this is what I'm expecting. But if you now set your psychology, I must, this thing must occur. No, that is if I see confirmation. That is if I see confirmation. So if I sent one confirmation for you. I did business. You know, now I will check your WhatsApp message. I know, I know, I know. Ekele, Ekele. So now, I'll be expecting price to what? To get here and what? Continue. But I don't want to set my psychology like, I don't want to fix it like, I must target this loop. As if I have a what? A confirmation. Fine, I will target this loop. But if I don't have a confirmation, I will continue with the what? The buy trend to the nearest supply zone. Then that supply zone can now literally what? Push the trend back to this place. It depends on what market was delivered. But if you are trying to sell from here, bah, you are seeing it wrong. But as for me, I am going to sell from here if I see confirmation and I will clear everything here. So the reason why this place stands as uh, liquidity, now those traders that make use of this point of interest will be happy. Sniper, we are in profit. And before you see it, one name, me that I know that I'm going to, 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 to yeah, this place has filled me already. So, I literally look for a buy to the nearest point of interest. Then you can see this place has turned as inducement for this. And this is my confirmation entry. For people that miss this trend, this is a confirmation entry. Both. Both. Yeah. Oh, I made use of that very place. You said that <clears throat> we are, those people that made use of that place are very lucky because price uh, that prepared okay. them for a while. But why do you... Uh, not consider that very, that very place as, as a valid, valid place to sell down. Okay. Now, I have I think you just joined the class. I have explained before. The reason why I, you know, consider this place as a valid place to what? To sell is, I have a proper what, point of interest for you. What price makes use of you is what? Is an area of transaction and price has already what? Mitigated and moved. But does not creates a major break of structure. This is just a minor break of structure. You can see you are still in this, within this trend. As many price came back from here, broke this structure, we have considered this piece as was major break. And that is number one conference. Number two, I need something like this to occur. A break, something like this to occur. Then this piece will now stand as inducement for this proper point of interest. Then I can say from here, because I have what inducement. But there's no any form of inducement. Don't mind all this minor, minor break. All these minor inducements, because they are still within this trend. I was what looking I'm, at that. You, you are looking at this, right? Yeah, I took oh. that very place. Uh, uh, hey. the, no, so, yeah, yeah, no, the second one at the top. This one? Yes, yes, absolutely. OK. Now, because price has already what mitigated everything here. All this please eh? a trap for you. And now, as many price does something like this, break a structure created inducement I or yeah, inducement I and give you a break. Now we'll consider this inducement I as well, the liquidity for this proper point of interest. But we don't have any form of inducement. And looking at this structure, we have something like this. Looking at this structure, we have something like this. Can you see now? We have a point of interest that has not been indicated. This place will stand as inducement. You can see we have a break. Let me draw it. Let me draw it properly again. We have uh, something like this. 
Yeah, something like this. Boom. We have a break of structure. After having a break of structure, this is the last eye. Are you with me? So this eye, we stand out as inducement for this point of interest. So that was the reason why I make use of this eye as the point of interest for the was this, this has been mitigated. But as I have something like this, as I have something like this, a break, then I will have consider this area as my word's continuation. And this will stand as what point of interest. But I don't have. So looking at this structure, higher high, higher low. Uh, sorry, lower high, lower low, lower high, lower low. This is inducement for this. That's why I make it of this words. I don't need any point of interest here. This is my point of interest. Do you understand? So follow the structure. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm with you. The reason why I feel they are confused is because they really don't know the meaning of it. By rule, the inducement is any lower lower eye. Is it lower eye? Yeah, any lower eye be, you know, below your pure eye. I don't know if you get no. That's, that's the meaning of inducement. That's not it. No, like that's not it. Let me talk. When we are talking about inducement. Yeah. Okay, okay. When we are talking about inducement, inducement can, can occur in any form. Now, if you should say any lower high. Now, let's see. Click now. Let's say we have something like this. Now, before I proceed, where is your inducement here? Uh, yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Okay. The no, first place. No. Okay. And now. That's the supply. Okay. Now let me now give you this. Do you know this place you call your inducement has turned to the proper point of interest for you? I'm coming. This place has turned to what? Proper point of interest for you. The reason why I said this place has not a proper point of interest for you is because we have a break. After having a break, we have inducement here. Inducement here. Since this one has created inducement for you, now price will now make use of this place for the, for the continuation of trend. For the continuation of trend. Then later, now make use of this place as it was the inducements for this one. But because you have inducements here, what you'll be using first is here. Because it is not possible for price to induce this one, induce this one, no. I Sometimes, think it's because this one broke structure. That's why you had to obey it first. Which one? Yes, it's broke it's, structure. And the inducement also breaks structure also. Yeah, the inducement also break a structure. Can you see? The inducement also yeah, breaks yeah. a structure. Yeah. Can you see? So this one has done inducements for what? This place. Now, see what price is doing. Price is now creating higher high, higher low, as I like going. But if you now consider the trend, after you have a major break or price has gotten to a particular place, this place, all this place will stand as liquidity. All this place will start as inducement for this first one. The reason why we do not make use of this first one is because this other point of interest has its own inducement so that is the reason why we are making use of this place first assuming this place does not have any inducement i'm coming to this assuming this place does not have any inducement assuming it's, it's, it did not have any inducement are you with me i will have considered this place can you see so that's just it so inducements can come in any form in any form. It does make can come in any words, in any form. This is my prior point of interest tomorrow. Anytime I wake up, I'm buying from here tomorrow to this area, to clear this area. And I mean it, I'm going to show you. And I will tell you the reason I'm buying from here tomorrow. So any question? Any question? 
Voilà. Il n'y a pas de question. Eh, hey, boss, this place, inefficiency, inefficiency is confusing me. Yeah. That's not an inefficiency. When we are talking about inefficiency, we have we are talking about less volatility in the market. Market is struggling to a point, particular point of interest, and it will be mitigating everything. Looking at this, bam, bam, bam. This is inefficiency. Is this is this fall I'm talking about the boss? This please. This fall like this. This one is this not inefficiency now. Down. This one is not inefficiency. This one is what void, liquidity void. When we are talking about liquidity void, favorable gap also. When we are talking about liquidity void, known as favorable gap, it is what volatility, strong move in the market. You can see all these candles are not closing. They are not see. We have imbalance and that imbalance. This is what void. Shake it. This is void. Liquidity what void, known as what favorable gap. This is volatility in the market. When we are talking about inefficiency, at this one, they are struggling in a particular area. And now, let me not tell you a secret about fair value gap. Fair value gap, if you notice, if a fair value gap is being created, a fair value gap is used for a continuation. Now, if you have a break of this demand and you have a fair value gap, price should come to that fair value gap instantly. Instantly. Price should come to the fair value gap instantly. If price should leave this fair value gap and go further and go on STP, this fair value gap is not valid anymore. Price should just react to it and break it. Fair value gap is used for continuation. Now, let's say we have a break of this was this loop. And you have what? We have gap. Yeah. I want to see price to come back instantly, mitigate it and go for continuation trend. Well, since you have a void here, you have imbalance, you are not expecting price. See what price does here. See this imbalance. Can you see price came to feel it? Did not sell massive. I'm expecting it. Okay, if truly uh, it is used for what? Another trend. Once price means to get it here, she be, it's supposed to continue the trend now. She, she be, you see, it is only used for continuation trend. So once you have a, a, a liquidity void, which is... Uh, Favor look up imbalance. Price should after price break a structure or a demand, whatever, price should use that please as continuation instantly. One, two, price should come back and fill it and come. But if you have a break of structure, I am not expecting price to not come back and fill it alongside you are doing yourself. Unless that void is a proper what supply zone. If it is a proper supply zone, you can still consider that place as what. Another trend, but if you have it this way, if you have it this way and you are expecting price to come and feel it like okay, from year to year, you are saying you have imbalance here. So people will not put entry at this 50 percent. You can see there's a weak reaction here. It will keep you out. Let me look for another example. Now look at this. Oh, boss, before you go, before you go, boss. Okay. Let me go back. Go back. Yes. You know there is a demand zone here. Have we? Mm-hmm. For a demand or supply. Demand. Sorry, a supply. No. This is it. When you are when you are trading, you need to check all your time frames. Now, looking at this. Looking at this, this is it. This area I mark is it. And if you are even marking this piece, what you need inside this piece is what OFC. And OFC has been, has been given. You have the OFC already. So you can't just be like, no, but... I'm coming. So because you have supply and set limits instantly, you are doing yourself now. Okay, you want to set limits here when you don't have inducements. And this look more confusing. Some, some people here, they know maybe they should use this one or this one or this one. So it is better you wait for a proper uh, OFC. You can ask that question you also ask. What's OFC? Change of order flow. So you know you used to go to the previous class we, I do say. Order flow change. 
Um, all right, boss. But, but question. Uh, okay, sorry for my question. Is, uh, I see that you did not say anything. I can't hear you, Adele. You need to. No stress me. Okay. Can you hear me? You are, you are, you are okay. skipping. You are cracking. Wait, 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 wait. Tell me. Oh, shit. That's good. Wait, all this is not dead in my chance for me. Now, can you hear me, sir? Yes, we can hear you. All right. Do you mean that... um? Any, any any trade that we want to enter, if there is no liquidity, we should not enter it, right? Not all. It depends. Now, looking at this, looking at this structure, this is the main structure leg. Everything here, low, high, low, high. This is liquidity for this. And this came back. Now, when, when price mitigate this place, we do not have any confirmation. There should be a confirmation. There should be a confirmation. This trade just go with momentum. And was broke structure. After price has cleared this inducement, this this trade goes with momentum and broke structure. And for we waiting for confirm for we confirmation traders, we don't have any confirmation yet. Now we'll be waiting for this area since we have a broke structure. I am still waiting for this area to confirm itself. And now looking at this uh break of structure, this is the last lower low. This is my words. External liquidity. Are you with me? You can see when price got here, we don't have any other words inducement around here. We don't have anything like this. Can you see? It is not every time yes. price we do. Since price has created it here as few the scenario here, this is just continuation. For continuation pattern, you know, it is not every time you need it. So this is this is the main project. This is the main project. Okay. What we are just looking for here is confirmation. So for we that you know see confirmation entry, price came back and confirm us. Can you see? Right. So for price to come back and confirm us, it doesn't need more liquidity. And looking at this, looking at this, like I said, price has been with momentum here. But when it gets here, it started ranging, 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 ranging. So we get here. So this is what our confirmation entry. In fact, we have two confirmation here. One confirmation and another confirmation when I explained it. For me, the first uh, one I pick, I use my conference. And for OFC trader, there's another entry. So it is not every time. But when you are in this scenario, where you need a main, like when you are looking into main projects, you need inducement for the continuation. You know, if you need a continuation trade like or a confirmation, it is not every time you wait for inducement. There's entry with inducement, and there's not there's another entry with stops in inducement. And looking at this now, looking at this. Okay, fine. You have seen we don't have any uh, inducements here, right? We don't have any uh, inducements, and price has was mitigated properly. Looking at this, price already created inducements for us. Now price does something like this. See you. Hi. Look. Can you see? So price has created inducements for you. So this is what another valid entry for you to make use of this word. This please. I like I said, I said I want price to come to my words in balance immediately. You can see this price is not going to TPR before coming back. So price has what price came back instantly and come and feel it. <laughs> She gets, and there are sometimes if you what if you set your trade, let me tell you some, another thing. Let's say you 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 saw that this is imbalance, yeah. You, you now set your limits and price did not come back there and, uh, and mitigate it and price feel everything it's needed to feel. Please just delete the limits. If you are holding price, will use that area as inducement. Price can now clear it up, then start selling. I don't so understand since, what you just said. Okay, now what I said is if you have any point of interest like this, now looking at this word imbalance, you have this imbalance and you set your limits there, and price did not come there anytime soon, and price went to eat your TP, and you are still holding, you still feel like when price still get there, it's going to sell. No, just delete it. It is not valid anymore. Nice. But price will just come there, kick it out, and start selling again, or go to any anywhere price is going to. Okay. So what about this very place? This very place now. No, please. I want to ask you something. Yeah, this very place. Wait. Oh god. This very place. This very place. 
Very good. Very good. Uh, it looks like a. Uh, what, what do you call it again? Or uh, liquidity hunt? I've been a. It's in. Stop hunt. Okay, hunt of liquidity. Uh, the hunt of liquidity. Okay. Now nah, this is came for our high at the top. Yeah. Okay, this is it. This is it. This is it. Now we we know we have a proper zone here. Whatever thing that is happening here, I don't need it. I am waiting for 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 the trade to come to my proper words point of interest. And looking at this, we have Quasimodo entry safe. Can you see? We have Quasimodo entry. For all, all, all you people that know, like shoulder, head, shoulder. See, shoulder, head, shoulder. We have Quasimodo entry. I want three the hard. Oh, so, oh but, sure. but me, I don't, I don't really fancy the other one. This is my surprise zone. But what I need here is what is a uh, OFC or any form of break of structure and liquidity. So any other thing that is happening around here, I don't care. I don't sell from here. What I'm going to do now? Let's let's see. We have low high. Let's let's read the structure. This place broke the structure and came back down. Now price break this place and went up. Yeah, looking at this, what are you looking for? Let me ask you a question. What are you looking for at this area? We used to be looking for a sell or a buy. You'll be looking for a buy. The reason why I said you'll be looking for a buy is because now this is not my point of interest. I have, I know my point of interest. I have my proper point of interest. Now looking at this, I'm going up. I'm going up. I have a what's a demand zone here. Now we have what I low, I low. We have a break of structure, and this demand mitigates properly. And this is already broke structure. It's already broke this supply. You can see everything here has been mitigated. This supply is everything here has been mitigated. So this area, everything here has been mitigated. So let's say price with this supply, even though this place is going to be valid, I don't need price to break it. So price are just breaking everything here. So now I have a break of what? We have 10 minutes more to go. I have break of demand and I'll just look for another entry to buy. I'll be looking for a buy to the nearest point of interest. So this place, I, I don't consider sell. Yeah, it is like I'm gambling the trade since I know my point of interest. That is why it is not good to just be looking for entry, 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 entry. Once you know what you are doing, just wait for it. Let's price get there. Do whatever thing it wants to do and continue. Because looking for entry, I want to scab buy, I want to scab say it will affect your psychology. So now when price got here, you can you can look for whatever thing you want to look for. You can look as many as possible for a sell entry, not a buy entry. Yes, if it is not safe enough, because price can come here and start selling. So don't like don't trade a counter trade. Since you know what you are looking for, just wait for it. Very very simple. Do you understand? Yeah, I would have entered uh, that very place, that the second entry that was created, but I don't touch your person today. Yeah, yeah, that, no, I... This very move that it was the second one, the first mm. one, that first one there. Yeah. You stopped me out because I think I, I told you before I chose the very that one, yes. And the first one, there was uh, I was thinking that market was going to make use of this very place in the morning to clear the very place. Oh, oh. network wait. This very place. That down, yeah. I know where you are targeting. Because I saw it on your status. Yes, yes, and markets are uh, fairly. Well, this. Yes, yeah, that very place. It's failed it. I was expecting my, my uh, price market to respect that very zone and break uh, all those Asian fashion liquidity. So, market failed it. And I was like, what the heck? <laughs> I'm trading Asha. Yeah, trading no Trading uh, is you, but we move, Asha. We move, we move, uh, we move. Yeah. We move. So, that's your state. Any other but I was correct. Yeah, you, you are, you are. There are sometimes you know, yeah. you know. There are sometimes safe. You will know this is. It's crazy to you. 
disputed liquidity. That that that. that, that you, will not, you will not know. You know this place is liquidity, but you will be confused. Um, okay, let me just um, you know trading is not easy. It is not. It is not easy. Yeah. It is not easy. Ah, it is not easy. Once you are profitable like this, thank God, thank your creator. It is not easy. Uh, even there are some of my friends that are, that are already profitable in this thing. And I was like, ah, well, I know, am I might not try this hard or is no. it something else? Or, ah. when, when they are saying profitable, like what they are doing, look here, they will not let you know. Hmm. It is only profit you will see. If they have blown like 10 accounts locally, you will not know. I won't lie to you. But once they make profits, they will let you know. And most of them, most of them, they don't know how to yeah. spend. But when you see them spending, you feel like they are profitable. Don't judge. Don't they will say don't judge book by cover? Yes. Because they are lost. They will not let you know that they have like three accounts. But they have enough money towards to continue. That's why you are feeling like they are profitable. Some they have enough money to continue. Even if they blew like 10 accounts, they still have another what money to continue. But you that you don't have money to continue, if you book blow three accounts, your psychology is what is being fucked with already. So that's just it. So don't feel like uh, you are still joking with your life. Do your things, fight with yourself. The problem is you have is yourself. Now fight the battle. Um I not, I, uh, you want yeah, I even wanted to have it. I wanted to attend this class today so I can ask you to analyze the GU uh, stuff for me so I can know my mistakes and what. And when I came online, I thought that you were already doing that already. So yeah, yeah. I was like, it seems like you know. This is EU today. For. This is EU today. I miss this cell though. I was waiting for your confirmation. Yeah, I saw it on Twitter. Yeah, I miss this cell. I was waiting for confirmation. Okay, miss the cell. Yeah, I miss this cell. This one, this particular cell. I miss it. I was waiting for confirmation, but yeah. price left. I know where price was consolidating at this point of interest. At this area. Yeah. Assuming I know for a long while, I would have said limits here because the reason why I did not say limits was because I forgot this place also haunted liquidity. You can see it's haunted liquidity and sold. And we have, you can see, we have inducement. Like I said, I want to see price do something like this. Continue. So if I was targeting this place, well, I forgot that we have inducements for this area. So I would have set my limits down. So I was waiting for, okay, this man has filled me. I was waiting for price to now come to this particular area. I'm not seeing the area you are pointing out to. Your, 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 your network. Network, okay. So I'm, I'm waiting for price to come to this particular area for confirmation. But price just left me and go. I forgot I slept on it. Even I would have been in this cell, or I would have caught the cell. Because this place really this liquidity and it has inducements. It has inducements. But nevertheless, not be everything person will chop. Yeah, <laughs> no, no, no. That one don't go. So that's just that about that for tonight. And um, we are done for, for liquidity. Where you are, no, we are not done. I still want to explain something more, but not tonight anymore. I still want to explain something more. Yeah. So that's just but, that. Uh, I want to say I'm desperate to I'm desperate about uh, making profits on this talk. Well, ah, God. <laughs> no, no, no. Just calm, just calm. That's that's not a problem, though. That's not a problem. Oh, see, let me say something. Let me say something. The secret you don't know is that, ha, ah, being profitable, it is you. You yourself, and I do see the if you are if you are fighting, if you are not fighting yourself, ah, uh, if you are trying to work on what you see on people's status, are you with me? If you are, if you are trying yeah. to work on what you see on people's status, it is going to affect you, because you want to do you what they are doing. Also, yeah, uh, my friend are profitable. I want to be profitable. Also, no, just fight with yourself first. Let's, there are some traders. They will have, let's say they have five set up. They will have three stop loss and have to take profit. That to take profit is enough for them. That to take yeah. profit you are seeing is enough for them. Due to reach to reach to yes. Early. So yeah, that you yeah. eat also yeah. you eat stop loss. Know how you eat stop loss. That's just it. You eat stop loss. You eat stop yeah. loss. 
So the only time, let me give you, the only time you will be more confident of what you are doing yeah. is when you are profitable enough, you have more than enough. Okay, let's say you have wake up this morning like this. You, you, you feel like eating chicken and chips. You ordered it with nice ice cream or nice yogurt. I'm not talking about fresh yogurt. Fresh yogurt is rubbish. I don't used to drink it. I have one yogurt that I used to drink. Um, I will shake the bottle before the yogurt come out. You know that kind of yogurt now. I will shake it very well. I'll be pressing it like this. So that kind of yogurt, you know, you, you went out, you went to gym, you know, you still come back. You have more, more than enough in your account. So if you analyze and save, you come down and analyze because you know you'll not be rushing for money. But if you are not profitable yet, you'll still be rushing for more. Let me just see five hundred dollars with the angle. That's where you're not be seeing it from. So it's a kind of process. Just if you, if you are still hitting stop loss, any what you are going to do is make sure you have good risk management so that the stop loss will not affect you. So even though you hit still stop loss and to take profit, even though you want to take profit, you'll be in profit. Because let's say you have you have five pips or three pips. You see me, I don't do that three pips, four pips, one pips. Okay, let's say you have five pips stop loss. You now use one lot size. That is fifty dollar loss. You have okay. use one lot size like three times minus one fifty, and now your take profit is hundred pips. You now eventually see a trade that around hundred pips. That is one thousand yeah. dollars. Now calculate that one minus one fifty in one thousand dollars. You are still left with what eight fifty. So do you want to tell me you're not profitable? You are. Right. So that's just it. Yeah, I'm not rushing to know you. Uh, you know. No, no for, no for. No for. Uh, no mind them. They didn't make profits, but there were some people they are trading, but um, to be profitable, no easy, oh God. God you no know easy. Uh -huh. So that's just it. That's all for tonight. Thank you very much. I have another class to attend. I like to teach all right, tonight. All right, all right. So take care. All right. Yeah. Thank you.